Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or hello if you're new. Yes, I've been off here for a week or two by now when this video comes up. I do upload every Tuesday and Thursday, but things are shifting a little bit right now, so I figured I'd update you guys real quick. Um, again, it's summertime, the kids are out of school, we don't have a sitter, and we have family visiting um, twice this summer. So we are taking full advantage of that and just enjoying the summer of 2021. So uh, right now we are at Christie Lodge in Avon, Colorado. Um, our grandparents, uh, the kids' grandparents, John's side, my husband's side is here taking care of the kids while we are out and about doing our thing um, for the first time ever, basically. So John and I are indulging, loving it, and I explain a little bit more here um, in the video, but I just did a tour of the hotel room, so stay tuned for that. And I talked a little bit about what we've already done because this is like the third day that we've been here. Um, so yeah, so stay tuned for that. And if you want to, follow me on my social media. I am posting here and there. Again, I'm trying to enjoy this time and I figured I better pick up the camera at least once uh, while we're out here to vlog. Um, but yeah, here we are. I hope you enjoy it. Front entrance. Well, they provided a fan for us. The desk. I do my makeup up. Makeup at. Occasionally. Over here. Hang up coats. Light jackets. And then our bed is right as soon as you walk into the door. And then there's a dresser. TV. There's a window there that goes out to the lobby. I can show you guys that too. Um, mirrored closet. It's quite small. But space to put some essentials. And then they have nice nightstands. Lots of lighting. The bed. The bed's not like uncomfortable but it's not my bed you know what I mean so um, I haven't slept very well lately so there is a pocket door here for the bathroom looks like they remodeled the bathroom recently and then yeah it's quite small but I mean everything fits accordingly I brought all my stuff I'm not really going to show that stuff side of things but the shower gets super hot everything's really comfortable in here um, so there's another door going out just in case if there's other guests here this room seats four um, so this door closes and then you can close the pocket door and somebody can go in there if they need to Okay, so John's in the shower now, and through this door there is where the fan was located. These doors creak quite a bit. There is no, like, quietness in the morning. <laughs> I guess I could have turned the light on. I don't know where it is, but there's so many light switches in here. And then this is a hot water heater in there. I think every room has their own. Um, okay, so this is the kitchen. Some pretty artwork right by the table. It's a really four person table. Everything's perfect. I told John, I said, when we're, uh, we don't have kids around, we're gonna be doing this more often. Maybe find a small place and then travel more. Um, yeah, it's beautiful. We don't know where we'll be at that time, but everything you need they stock everything I brought my own wine you have to provide your own food of course coffee I'm gonna make that as soon as I'm done here but you got cups microwave there's even a dishwasher <clears throat> the sink is quite large one burner they provided all the soap and towels um, we just finished breakfast there's a Coffee, um, maker, toaster, ice, full set of knives, um, 
I don't think there's anything up there. And then there's even stuff for like cooking meals, hot meals. Um, I don't know why they have this because they don't have an oven. I don't know why they would have that, but yeah. And then in here, the refrigerator's super cute. It's small, but it, I mean, of course, takes care of everything that you need. Um, pots and pans are up here. Yeah. And I don't think I mentioned it, but we're at Christie Lodge in Avon, Colorado. Luggage, and then our view is a road, but that's okay. We're not here for sitting in the, um, hotel room we're here to adventure out shoes that's the AC unit during the winter time they have a fireplace that you can get wood and put the fire on and a nice TV so that's pretty much everything I'll show you the outside real quick curtains are nice there's two chairs out there with a little table uh, we are on the first floor this Christie Lodge has like three floors and it's huge I'll go show you that real quick, but then I wanted to show you guys this um, wine place. It's probably like more of a, all kinds of liquors, um, but they have a vehicle that says Winebulance. <laughs> I thought that was cool. So let's go see the lobby. Okay, to my right, there is an indoor pool, but it is under construction right now, but they have an outdoor pool and it is summertime, so ping pong tables. They have a hockey table down here. We fill our waters up right down there. It's really convenient. Ice makers are up there. And going outside to our car, there's these exits everywhere. Um, this is what it looks like, Christie Lodge. And then we've gone down to this hot tub once. Talked with the gentleman for like an hour straight. It was kind of nice. We didn't know who he was, but um, they have these little fireplaces everywhere. As you can imagine, lots and lots of snow here. So it's probably really nice to come back to your hotel and get in the pool or indoor pool, hot tub, or sit by the fire. Yeah, and there's some shops in here too. Active Center, yeah, there's a hockey puck table and a pool table, we've done that. So they gave us a newspaper and this chart just to make sure we know where everything is. So I figured that I would do my makeup and just talk to you a little bit about the adventures that we've been on so far. Um, the first day we got here was really late so I don't think we did anything that night. We just went to bed shortly after getting here and getting settled in. Um, the next day we went horseback riding in the morning and that was a two hour tour in Beaver Creek Stables. Um, it's right there on the slopes in the summertime. Um, it's a horse trail instead of a snow mountain ski and snowboard resort so um i'm all for trying skiing at some point while out here but where i'm at is i love the horses and i want to go on the horse so john and i actually really enjoyed that i think we would do it again um i'd probably feel a little bit more comfortable on the horse the next time around um because I haven't been on a horse in a really long time. So, that being said, I gotta get started on my makeup. This morning, uh, we're going to go four-wheeling, and I'm super excited, because I haven't been on a four-wheeler in a while, um, since being at my parents' house this past six months. So it's been a little while since I've been on a four-wheeler, so I'm looking forward to that. Um, but yeah, that's what we're doing now. We're gonna get ready and go get coffee, then go to the four-wheeling place and have a great time for two hours with guides. I've never um, four-wheeled, four-wheeled, <laughs> four-wheelered 
in mountains. So I'm not really sure how that's gonna go, but John wanted me to ride with him. However, I like to ride. So um, I said, if you're not gonna let me ride, then I want to order two quads. And that's what we did. So I'm not going to film probably for that just because I'm trying to enjoy myself as much as possible with John because we don't ever get to do this kind of thing um, so far in our marriage. We haven't, uh, but grandma and grandpa are taking care of the kids. So it's like amazing. <laughs> I'm like, who am I? I don't have to worry about any, any kids running around right now. I'm like, who am I? So it's a different experience, but it's a good one. And I'm trying to indulge in it as much as possible. We've other activities we've already done. Um, the hot tub, the pool, uh, we went to a lake, it looked like a lake. I've got a picture of it on my Facebook and Instagram. Uh, that's my profile picture now of John and I, and I don't know. It was beautiful. Mountains everywhere. We haven't seen any like dangerous wildlife yet. Um, I don't know if we will. We thought about going zip lining and rafting, um, like whitewater rafting, kayaking, canoeing. There's just so much to do here. I love it. I love it. <laughs> so nice. All seasons, you know? So, I don't know, I, I know why people like to come here. But during this season, summertime, um, it's pretty quiet and I actually like it. Uh, from what the people at the horse table, horse stable said, most people that live here and own property aren't here at this time of year. Um, I'm not sure why, because it's amazing. Uh, but the houses out here are ridiculous. Ridiculous. <laughs> I'm like, how? How do you guys do this? I don't know. Um, it's, it's amazing. And we haven't even gone up to the Beaver Creek area as far as like the housing area. There's a, um, a sign where the rich people live that says basically don't come on private property and it's a road going up to their properties. Um, but yeah, that's how the rich get away from society, I guess. But all right, so that face part is done. We talked to a guy for like an hour. I told you guys out there, talked to a guy for like an hour. He's a construction worker and he's working in Vail with a crew for the past month. And he told us that maybe four times <laughs> he was drinking. <laughs> he was drinking a lot of alcohol. Um, and then the next day we saw him in the lobby and he didn't recognize us. So you could tell. So, <laughs> but he was really nice. He, I mean, good conversation. John and I were talking with him, but he didn't remember us in the morning. Um, <laughs> oh no, I got to get a towel real quick okay I'm back so I don't know what else I'm missing but we've done a lot and it's been really really fun I did a little bit of shopping for Ava and Asher they're enjoying their time with grandma and grandpa they actually went to the zoo yesterday and they got us zoo passes so like we're gonna be able to go often and the kids are just getting to that age where it's easy to take them now so I'm happy about that for sure. Um, Asher starts preschool two days a week uh, in August, I believe. And then Ava goes back full time Monday through Friday, hopefully. Hopefully no issues with COVID. Who knows? But I'm just gonna finish up my makeup and then we're gonna go four wheeling and I'll pop in here and there. We went to two bars, basically. One of the bars, we just had like french fries and a pretzel with a couple beers. No, one beer. And then um, we went to another place that had a bar in it, which was a pizza place. 
and it was like super good. We, we might go back to that one. It's right by the hotel. I can't think of the name right off the top of my head, but um, it's super good. So if you ever come this way, just look for the pizza place right by Christie Lodge. Um, yeah. And we've been trying a lot of craft beers, like uh, go in the grocery store. We went to the grocery store last night here in um, Beaver Creek, Avon area. And John was amazed by the cheese selection for the Ritzy people. He's over here listening to me. But yeah, he enjoyed that. There was a huge, what kind of cheese was it? There's two of them. Parmesan. Parmesan, big pinwheel, Parmesan. huge pinwheel. Um, am I saying that right, pinwheel? It's just basically a big block of cheese from Italy. Two wheels from Italy. Two wheels, yeah. Um, and then the rest of the cheese was labeled from everywhere around the world. And this is just like a regular uh, grocery store. But when you're close to more ritzy people, you get all the options. And nothing around here is cheap. So John and I got a rotisserie chicken, and what else did we get last night? Mac and cheese, made mac and cheese. You can cook here, you can cook in this hotel like I showed you earlier. Um, yeah, all right, so I'm done getting ready. We're gonna go get coffee and go four-wheeling, yay. I'll check back in with you guys later. If I could talk, that'd be great. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Supplies I'm going to be taking today on four-wheeling adventures, some beef jerky, nut mix, um, face sunscreen spray and body spray, keys of course, and a water bottle with a satchel here. This can go across my body or it can go on my waist. So, yeah. Okay, so we're back now from four wheeling it was a lot of fun i'll have some like videos uh or pictures inserted if i can or you can find them on my social media if you want to see what it looks like up on top of a mountain <laughs> so um yeah we were like 11,000 feet or something and we drove the four wheeler up there and then walked a little bit took pictures and then came back had some pizza at that place again <laughs> Um, and a margarita, yeah. Um, it is, mind you, like 1.30 in the afternoon, so we're gonna go and walk down to the pool, the outdoor pool here, and see if it is busy. And if it is, we're probably gonna just hang out around the hotel room for a little bit and then go to a lake nearby this afternoon. So, that's what's up. I might take my camera to the lake. Might, I don't know, but maybe. <laughs> 